a princess, too. What kind of a princess are you? Uh, do you have magic hair? No. Magic hands? No. Do animals talk to you? No. Were you poisoned? No. Cursed? No. Kidnapped, Kidnapped or, or enslaved? enslaved? No. Are you guys okay? Should I call the police? Karina Lisette Amaya Gomez. I gave birth at 15 and this is why I'd never recommend being a teen mum. I see all the time people saying that they want to be a teen mum and just don't do it. People will say to you, it gets easier, but it doesn't. It's just got 10 times harder the older she gets. You have to be so selfless, you can't see your friends as much, you have to turn down plans, you have to worry about money, finances, what the baby needs, lack of sleep. I did my GCSEs with a one-year-old and trust me, it was not fun. Postpartum depression, anxiety. This is what being a teen mum is. Not even a teen mum, just a mum in general. It is hard. And trust me, mums do not get credited enough for what they do. You have to see your friends going out and enjoying themselves while you're stuck at home with a baby. I love my daughter Ivy and I would never take her back, but it is goddamn hard and I would not do it if I was you. Okay, don't worry girl, I got your back from right here. Kirsten. Hi. Hi. Two months of being a mom, how's it going? Good. What's the best thing? The cuddles and the kisses. What's the hardest thing? Him screaming at three in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. How's school going? Good. You're almost finished with your junior year? Yeah. Is it hard with the baby? Yeah. <laughs> Does mom and dad do everything for you? No. Has mom gotten up one single time in the middle of the night? No. No? No. No? No. Would you recommend being pregnant and being a mom at 16? No. But is, is, is it as hard as what everybody thought, said it was going to be? No. Do you feel like your whole childhood is gone? No. What's advice that you give to teens that are thinking about getting pregnant mm -hmm. or not using safe sex? Don't do it. <laughs> Unless you want to not hang out with your friends for a little bit, then you're fine. <laughs> yep. Or if you just want to wake up eight times a night, go for it. Yep, good advice. When Does anyone else's school have pregnant teens? Baby mamas, this your son been pregnant for way too long. Too long. Now tell the DJ to Yes, I had a kid at 13 years old, and I'm eating a corn dog right now. I feel like it's every year I have to readdress the fact that I had my son at a mere 13 years old. I literally killed that corn dog. It's gone. 
It's gone, baby. Um, but the story behind me being 13 and pregnant is literally, I was 13 years old. I was naive. And uh, I started dating a 16-year-old guy. I was in seventh grade. He was a sophomore in high school. And uh, he got me pregnant, then deuced out, and pretty much hasn't been a part of my son's life ever since. This is a picture of my son and I back in 2014. I was 13 in this photo, and he was a newborn, obviously. January 23rd, that's his birthday. And this is me and my son now. I am 22, and he is going to be 9 next month. Don't be a teen mom, okay? Because your baby daddy ain't going to be shit. Literally, my son, he needs two rounds of braces. He just got his first round of braces off. We got them at the same time. Four grand, I was like, baby daddy, you gonna split it with me? He was like, I'm not gonna pay for a kid I don't see. Is it me, or are we best friends? Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely your best friend. And that's, that's great for you. Oh, heck no! <clears throat> no! Those girls are all boobs and no brains. I'm too busy, in a library, reading books with dust on them. Oh, psh. The youngest mothers in the world. Lena Dressa Middleton. She gave birth when she was 12 years old. Medina. Gave birth when she was five years old. No, no, no. 